Hey you guys. So I had to tell you about these chips. I've just finished the bag and I was not expecting to even like them. I literally bought them. So you know how you go to Marshall's. I don't know if other stores like TJ Maxx or Ross or any of those stores have this section, but there's a section in Marshall's where they sell food items. You know, I love to go in that section because I find some of the most unique food items that I never see anywhere else. And usually when I see them there, I only see them the one time. There are certain exceptions in certain things that I see, like maybe some cashews or pistachios or something pretty basic like that. But when it comes to specialty items in that section, different kinds of syrups and like if you like to drink, there's different kinds of flavored liqueurs and stuff like that. I always see something new and unique that when I go back, they don't have it anymore. And these, I'm always in that section. Every time I go to Marshall's, I go over there just to see. Sometimes I find herbal products that I love that are unique, different blends. So today, no, that's a lie. I didn't eat all of this today. <laughs> Um, probably about a week ago, I love potato chips, but I had to stop eating them just because they're not healthy for me at the end of the day. That's like my little cheat, but I'm in the process of doing a real serious overhaul of my digestive system. And so I had to leave the potato chips alone months ago, but I still have that urge to want some potato chips. I don't eat popcorn anymore. That was one thing that I used to like to snack on. I'm a snacker. Um, and I found these chips. Now, as you can see, it says Jackson's and these are sweet potato chips. What I love about them is the ingredients. Well, not only are they, um, non GMO, they are definitely gluten-free made in a facility that is gluten-free, allergen-free. They are vegan and the ingredients is what I am most impressed about. Because even when you find natural items like this, usually there's one or two things in there that, that they put in there that's not a whole food. It's like something that they derived from a plant to help it to have better shelf life. The ingredients on these sweet potato chips, by the way, this was my first time actually having sweet potato chips. It's just never something that I craved. It's never something that I'm like, mm, those must be good. But for some reason I saw these and I'm like, you know what, just give it a try. Well, first what I did was look at the ingredients because I do that with every food thing that I buy in a package. Um, the ingredients, you guys, sweet potatoes, avocado oil and sea salt. That is it. And I'm like, no way. It's hot in here. <laughs> I should have turned the air on before this anyway. Um, yes. So I looked up the company just to see what they were all about. They have other flavors. Um, do your research on them. Jackson's. So it's a couple with a few children and they have a son. His name is Jackson and he was dealing with autoimmune issues, which is usually how products like this are derived because someone has an issue where they can't consume the normal stuff. And so they go in the kitchen and they try and recreate one of their favorite snacks or something like that. Well, that's what happened here. The son names Jackson. That's really cute. I love that they named it after him. Um, it's kind of like that Siete brand where one of the daughters had some sort of issue, a major gluten intolerance or something like that. And so they developed this whole line of food items. I'm not too crazy about them because they do kind of deal with some fillers to help things to be shelf stable. But those right there, you guys get them look for them jackson's they have regular potato chips they had a habanero they have these and i can't remember there was there's quite a few others but they got their start from being on shark tank back in 2018 or 17 something like that so yes if you want to support a small business i honestly don't know how small they are at this point you know shark tank has the, has the tendency to help people to blow up but 
give those chips a try you won't be disappointed i actually like sweet potato chips now hopefully the next time i find some they are as good as these hopefully i can continue to find these like i said i got them from marshall's the price was right and the taste is good so i just wanted to give that little review for those of you that like to snack like i do and you're looking for something healthy thank you subscribe to this channel give this video a thumbs up love you see you next time